Welcome back to Auto Bike Reviews. Today, we are stepping beyond wheels and into the skies as we dive deep into India's next generation fighter, the HAL Tejas MK2, slated to redefine the Indian Air Force's frontline combat capability in 2025. Built on lessons learned from the Tejas MK1 and MK1A programs, the MK2 is not just an evolution, it's a transformative leap in indigenous aerospace technology. With enhanced combat range, increased payload, and integration of 4.5-generation technologies, the Tejas MK2 is India's bold statement of self-reliance and strategic ambition. Design and Airframe Evolution The Tejas MK2 features a lengthened airframe, increasing fuselage length from 13.2 meters in the MK1 to 14.6 meters. This change accommodates more fuel, increased weapon hardpoints, up from 8 to 11, and a more powerful engine. The redesigned air intake and broader wingspan not only improve aerodynamics but also reflect a major shift in mission capability. Composite materials still dominate, ensuring a low radar signature and high durability, while the overall design now supports both conventional and carrier-capable configurations. Power Plant and Performance at the heart of the Tejas MK2 is the GE F414 INS6 turbofan engine, a massive upgrade over the F404 used in earlier models. With 98 knots of thrust, it propels the aircraft to speeds beyond Mach 1.8 and provides a combat range of over 1,500 km without refueling. This performance edge, combined with in-flight refueling capability, transforms the MK2 from a tactical support fighter to a strategic multirole platform. Its agility and thrust-to-weight ratio make it a formidable opponent in both dogfight and beyond visual range scenarios. Avionics, Radar, and Combat Systems The MK2 features an advanced indigenous Uttam AESA radar, capable of detecting, tracking, and engaging multiple targets simultaneously with electronic warfare support. Its cockpit is all-glass, pilot-centric, and fully integrated with AI-assisted mission management. A new wide area display, voice command interface, and fly-by-wire systems provide unprecedented pilot control and situational awareness. The MK2 will also support modern air-to-air -air and air-to-ground weapons like the Astra missile, Scalp, and possibly Media, offering deep strike capabilities and network-centric warfare readiness. Strategic Role and Global Implications More than just a fighter, the Tejas MK2 represents India's commitment to strategic autonomy in defense manufacturing. With production set to begin in 2025, HAL plans to deliver over 100 units in the coming decade, replacing aging fleets of Mirage 2000s and Jaguars. It will serve as a bridge until the AMCA stealth fighter is operational. The MK2 also has strong export potential, with interest from Southeast Asia and Latin America. For India, it marks a decisive step in countering regional threats while boosting the Atmanurba Bharat mission. Conclusion the 2025 HAL Tejas MK2 is not just a machin, 